So this is a 2003 Mercury two-stroke 3.3 horsepower outboard engine and I bought it for a very as-is price off of somebody from Facebook Marketplace and it turned out to be seized which isn't a big surprise he said it was working last time he used it came off of a boat he bought and he upgraded the outboard to a larger one and he just had this sitting for a few two or three years so what I've been doing is I have been spraying every night and morning for the past four mornings the cylinder through the spark plug here and hopefully now that will be enough to uh, break free. So I'm going to use a breaker bar on the uh, crankshaft bolt. I'm going to have to take off the, all the housing and everything and the tank and try that out. And for the past four days, uh, because the engine seized, I've been spraying a uh, penetrating oil, penetrating catalyst, PB blaster, into the cylinder here every morning and evening and then, you know, plugging it back. So I don't want to disassemble this uh, recoil. Uh, I did that on my previous uh, outboard accidentally and basically there was no way it was going to be worth saving because of how much it would have cost to replace or repair it. So here we have the uh, crankshaft nut. So I'm going to try with the breaker bar to get that moving. I'm going to try and see if I can get the crankshaft moving. Uh, I can't find the breaker bar I just bought but I've just got a regular socket wrench here and a 17 millimeter socket. I've got a rag here covering the where the spark plug goes so let's try. moving. The PB blaster worked. Well, now I'm going to reassemble and uh, see if I can get it running.
So I bought a new spark plug here and I'm going to install the new spark plug. So now I'm going to try and get this started. Open up the fuel. Turn on the vent, open up the vent. You can see there's smoke coming out of it. Holy sh so here's one issue I just realized. This has a neutral, but my previous outboard didn't even have a neutral, it just had forward. So now I'm going to try and start it in neutral. Choke on. So ultimately, the motor started dying again, and I wound up rebuilding it, replacing all of the seals, and I never got it running again. It was probably overheating because it had bad compression, bad gaskets.